All right, we're back. I uh, just had to check and make sure I had enough uh, room on my hard drive for a couple more videos. So I think what we have to do is, uh, <clears throat> like, we can't just walk up and steal one of these eggs. Well, maybe we can. Yeah, what you're supposed to do is, like, um, beat her into submission and then steal an egg while she's asleep. <clears throat> but we're cheating because we're hunters and we're jerks. But uh, Nixandra is actually uh, one of Deathwing's um, consorts, I think. I'm not 100% sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. Go, 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 go. Yay! That didn't take nearly as long as I was anticipating. Uh, remember, Goblin, this is for the good of the Black Dragon Flight. We are here to redeem them, not to hurt them. This is but a step in their recovery. You have done everything that I've asked you. Without question, our job here in Leth Lethlore Ravine is done. It is now time that I reveal everything to you. Uh, stamina and intellect. Stamina and intellect. Okay, which one's going to be higher? Alright. Nice. Who did we get? Uh, oh, Exalted with uh, Meyer Guild. Sweet. What's time to flies? Earn Exalted with your guild. Uh, as I hinted earlier, I'm not ordinary goblin. You may have already guessed my true identity. Allow me to show you my true form, as you have proven yourself trustworthy. Oh, yeah, she is a red dragon. Rhea Straza. Uh, my true name is Rhea Straza, and I'm an envoy of Alex Straza herself, the aspect of the Red Dragon Flight. And we are going to meet her because she is a hottie, and you, you can't help but, yeah, anyway. With, Death, with Deathwing currently occupied with other matters, we are going to find a way to redeem the Black Dragon Flight, and you are going to help us. I made a calculated decision in revealing my identity to you, Goblin. I needed you to trust me, but I can no longer stay here in Lethlor Ravine as my cover has clearly, quite clearly been blown. <laughs> you may be able to slip away unnoticed, however. Here, take the results of our research and bring them west. At Agmon's end, you will find a gnome who knows what to do with these samples. Hurry, Goblin. We, you mustn't loiter here any longer than necessary. Aw, I was hoping she would like flies over there, but... Uh, yeah, there's a... Yeah, I don't know why it keeps uh, making that come up. Like, uh, like when I go to skin something, it's reading it as low health again. Oh well. There's a lot of like little, or not a lot, but there's some small issues. Uh, hopefully, they'll they'll kind of iron those out. Well, actually, I'm sure that they will. But... <clears throat> Oh, watch out there. Uh, that was almost a huge mistake. That's a uh, horde camp right there. I 
I'd forgot that that was there. Pleased to meet you. Dr. H. Blam, at your service. How can I be of assistance to you today? Ah, uh, ooh, sign stuff. Let's see what you've got in here. Wild eggs, blah, useless. These are never any good. Oh, what's this? Some sort of pre-engineered egg? This looks promising, but I don't want to know what Rhea had to do to get it. Hmm, yes, yeah, some very nice corpses. Very nice indeed. All right, I'll see what I can do. Uh, I'll need some time to analyze these samples, as well as a break from this trog shooting duty. Go man one of my turrets and take out as many trogs as you can. I'll be here studying. The turrets have two abilities, a regular shot as well as electrical overload for when too many enemies get close. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, and look out for the big slow trogs. You'll probably won't, don't want to let them get anywhere near you. Uh, a gun, which is... Um, be you. Uh, will be good to sell. Because uh, I uh, whoop, equipped our screeching bow and it is awesome. Usually there's a targeting reticle. I don't know why it's not uh, why it's not doing that. Oh well. All right, first wave done. As you can see, the uh, area of effect on these things is enormous, so it's, you don't have to get even, you just have to get like approximately close and uh, Oh, I hit myself. Not good. Yeah, this would be challenging if the uh, cooldown was a little higher. There we go. See? Easy. Wow, well, 
I can't believe we're almost level 50 already. That is awesome. Uh, as you can see, our uh, quest rewards are now pretty much always giving... Um, Uh, about a gold apiece, or uh, the quest rewards are getting uh, better. <laughs> Lord. Uh, I've got an idea, but it's a bit of a long shot. Thankfully, long shots happen to be a specialty of mine. North of here, the Explorer's League has uncovered a new set of Titan ruins beneath the sands. If there's anything older and wiser than dragons, it's Titans. Heck, I've heard rumors that the Titans created the dragons. Talk to the lead prospect prospector Darden at the camp to the north. I have more information than I do about the Titans. What did I tell you? It's a long shot. <laughs> Off and away. Yes, HD brown stuff again. Oh well. But at least we get a uh, another flight path. That'll be handy. Whoa! whoa. How are ya? Titans, you want to know about Titans? You came to the right place, lad. We're on the brink of something big. All's fair in love, war, and archaeology. First things first, though. I'm not just going to sit here and tell you everything we've discovered down in those ruins. We've got problems to take care of. Most pressing is those upset reliquary hooligans. Yeah, we can, we can take care of those for you. Save travels, great to me. Uh, let's see what he's got. A dwarf's got needs. I can appreciate a good digging as much as any other dwarf. Don't get me wrong. It's just that, well, we do so much digging and so little drinking that sometimes I wonder if I should just hang up my shovel and head back to Ironforge. But not today. I've got some digging in me yet. Uh, those dark iron dwarfs at Hammertoe's dig site just north of here make some powerful fine beer. Right here in the desert. You think you could go pick up a few for me? Fifteen mugs of Shadow Stout. See you soon. Uh, yeah, we can go on and do that. That's that's pretty quick. Oh. <clears throat> and these guys will drop really quick. So. Yeah, and I think it's a guaranteed drop. On these guys, so I was actually, uh, I know I said in, uh, in the last video I was going to, uh, we're here to do some skinning and stuff, but I'm actually ready for, um, Searing Gorge, which is a pretty interesting little dungeon, or dungeon, yeah, interesting zone, um, but, um, like I said, I want to, I want to do some skinning and stuff here and, uh, uh, these quests can uh, go by pretty quick, so. And we're still getting excellent rewards from them. See, they're, they're still yellow, so. But yeah, um, now it's it's actually a good thing if you're in uh, doing instances to uh, pick up gray items, especially weapons, because uh, those will sell for uh, a gold uh, pretty handily. Um, and we're saving up for our level 60 mount training, 
which we need uh, about 450 I think <clears throat> so it's uh, definitely something that uh, that you want to do and this is also uh, an archaeology point um, it's not right now there are uh, uh, your archaeology uh, dig sites uh, rotate. Um, oh wow, it's not guaranteed. Huh. Uh, so, <clears throat> well, some of them are dropping too, and. And that guy didn't drop any, so. Alright, one more. And we'll... weird. Usually those, uh, those drop them. But... Dude, it looks like you've had enough already. Got a little proposition for you if you're interested. Those Dark Irons were here before Darden and his crew arrived. That means that once these Titan ruins open up, the Dark Irons were the first ones in there looting all the good stuff. I bet they still got some treasures locked up inside Angor Fortress northwest of here. Uh, New shoulders, maybe. Yeah, we'll, Off with you. we'll consider doing that. Um, but you know, I think that's fairly close to 20 minutes-ish. So, uh, I'm going to go on and stop the video here. And I will see you back in a few minutes. And as always, if uh, you want to subscribe, go ahead. And if you like my content, give me a like. And uh, leave a comment down below. And I'll see you in the next video.